Various high data rate communication standards are available in today's communication environment. Still, none meet the communication requirements of sensors and control devices. These high data rate communication protocols necessitate low latency and low energy usage even at lesser bandwidths. In this video, we are going to talk about the Zigbee technology. So before starting this video, please like the video and subscribe to this channel for our future updates. Home automation systems are the next generation wireless network control systems that can control your house, including surveillance, electronics, and appliances through smartphones or tablets, or the number one automation control hub system installed on the wall. Today, we will introduce the next gen technology for home automation systems on low cost and low power wireless IoT networks, the Zigbee. What is Zigbee? Zigbee is a low power, low data rate wireless technology that shares many networking, security, and interface prevention technologies and protocols with Wi Fi. On its devices, Zigbee uses the IEEE. 802.15.4 Physical Radio Specification In 2003, the Institute of Electrical and Electronics Engineers approved the 802.15.4 specification, which Zigbee uses. The IEEE 802.15.4 specification is a packet-based radio protocol designed to increase interconnection efficiency in low-cost battery-operated devices. Zigbee is among the most popular networking protocols for allowing intelligent home devices from various manufacturers to communicate with one another. How does it operate? What makes it appealing to over 400 companies? The coordinator, located at the heart of the Zigbee network, sends a message to a router, then transfers it to an end device with orders to carry out a specific task. It's a short-range data transmission technology standard. A coordinator, routers, and end devices are the three types of devices found in a typical Zigbee network. These devices operate together as a light bulb to convey messages and directions from the central coordinator to the individual end units. The coordinator is the most powerful device in the network, and it resides at its heart. Each network has only one coordinator responsible for a variety of tasks. They generate a unique ID to the grid, assign an individual IP address to each device within the network, and originate and transfer messages or instructions by completing a channel scan and choosing the most suited one with the minimal possible amount of interference. In the smart home market, the term Zigbee is frequently used. It is advertised on the packaging of many different innovative home products. But Zigbee is a wireless technology standard for short-range wireless communication systems. It is an open-source standard established by the Zigbee Alliance, founded in 2002 and today includes hundreds of companies worldwide. Zigbee is designed for control and sensor networks in which specific devices are monitored and others are managed. Wi-Fi and Bluetooth aren't quite adequate for this application. Zigbee provided a solution to a problem that many people experienced. It is a low-cost option for low-power, low-data-rate devices that operate over a limited distance. It is the most widely adopted IoT standard. IoT simply refers to the billions of physical devices connected to the internet and collecting and sharing data worldwide. When you think about it, it's easy to see why Zigbee is such a popular wireless communication standard and not only in the smart home industry. Both Wi-Fi and Zigbee have advantages, but they also have disadvantages. Wi-Fi gains bandwidth at the expense of battery life and operability. In contrast, Zigbee achieves energy efficiency at the cost of range and bandwidth. Understanding trade-offs is critical for any decision based on link budgets. Utilizing one of the available Zigbee coordinators, you can connect various off-the-shelf Zigbee-based devices straight to Home Assistant using the ZHA, Zigbee Home Automation Integration. ZHA uses Zigbee, an open-source Python package that implements a hardware-independent Zigbee stack. ZHA can be used with any Zigbee compatible coordinator. Zigbee, a home automation system, 
can support devices like climate control systems, fans, bulbs, lights, locks, sensors, sirens, alarm control panels, binary sensors, and support grouping of lights, fans, and switches, i.e. commanding devices group support as entities. Because there is no globally acknowledged protocol for home automation, it is difficult to explain how it works. Technology used differs by country, company, and automation type. Companies frequently hide significant development since the home automation sector is profitable and fast-paced. X10 was the first home automation industry standard. X10 allows devices to communicate with one another via power line connections, radio frequency, and wireless protocols. Zigbee, Z-Wave, and Insteon are all popular home automation protocols today. Modern wireless technology, such as mesh networking, is used more significantly in these new industry standards. These systems are all quite complex. They send and receive messages using energy, radio waves, and wireless technologies. The star, mesh, and cluster tree topologies are the most often used Zigbee network topologies. One or more coordinators are present in any topology. The network in a star topology has one coordinator who is in charge of in who is in charge of initiating and managing the devices on the web. All other devices that interact directly with the coordinator are end devices. This architecture is utilized in businesses where all endpoint devices must connect with the central controller, and it is straightforward to implement. The Zigbee network is extended with numerous routers in mesh and tree topologies. The coordinator is in charge of starting them. These arrangements let any device communicate with another nearby node to provide data redundancy. These topologies automatically redirect information to other devices if any node fails. Mesh topology is commonly utilized in industry since redundancy is a crucial feature. Each cluster in a cluster tree network has a coordinator and leaf nodes. These coordinators are connected to the parent coordinator who starts the entire network. Zigbee is a communication technology comparable to Bluetooth and Wi-Fi. Still, there is also a slew of other emerging network options, such as Thread, which is a choice for home automation applications. White space technologies were introduced in major cities for IoT-based wider area use cases. The Zigbee protocol is standard for low-power wireless local area network. Turn off a battery and provides fewer data using less power from regularly connected devices. As a result, the open standard has been linked to M2M -M communication and the industrial Internet of Things. Zigbee has become a widely used embedded system protocol competing with Bluetooth, Wi-Fi, and Thread. Zigbee has many advantages, like this network has a flexible network structure. The battery life is adequate. It is straightforward to reduce power consumption. It can accommodate up to 6,500 nodes. Less expensive. It is both self-healing and more dependable. Setting up a network is both straightforward and easy. Because there is no central controller, loads are equally spread over the web. Using a remote, you may easily monitor and operate your home appliances. The web is scalable, and adding removing Zigbee end devices is simple. As nothing reached up to perfection, there are some disadvantages of Zigbee. It requires system information to control the owner's Zigbee-based devices. It is insecure when compared to Wi-Fi. Huge cost replacing Zigbee-based home appliances when they break down. The Zigbee transmission rate is lower. Several end devices are not included. Being utilized for official private information is quite dangerous. Because of its limited reach, it is not employed as an outdoor wireless communication system. Like other wireless networks, this Zigbee communication system is vulnerable to illegal interference. Samsung, Bosch, Honeywell, Texas Instruments, and Amazon are among the leading manufacturers of Zigbee products. Indeed, Amazon's Echo Plus included a Zigbee hub 
for controlling Zigbee devices. Samsung's SmartThings devices also communicate via Zigbee. It's encouraging to see that big name brands and a diverse range of devices embrace Zigbee. For all this information and details, we can conclude that Zigbee is a low power, low data, wireless network technology. Zigbee devices can be readily joined to a network, such as a mesh network to interact with one another. It's suitable for applications like home automation, where devices don't interact much and are nearby. The built-in power saving function of Zigbee is a remarkable feature that allows machines to survive considerably longer on a battery than alternative network protocols. I hope you all give Zigbee devices a try for home automation. What do you think of the video? Tell us about your favorite part of the video in the comment section below. If you enjoyed this video and want to see more home automation videos, subscribe and leave a comment saying I subscribed. I'll personally reply to your comment. Thanks for watching. See you next time.